Passion de amor. Well, I guess I'll have to watch the video. <laughs> it's sad to see all these creeks dry during the rainy season. Is that enough? <laughs> it's pretty cold. I got away from you. Ah! <laughs> and we're off. We stopped and got our guide. It was uh, 20 bucks for both of us, so 10 bucks each. I'm not sure if that's the going rate or if that's the gringo, gringo rate, but <laughs> we're excited to go check out Las Cascadas. Uh, we were here before, if you missed that video, we came up here and did a hike up to Las Pacinas, the pools, and we saw the howler monkeys. That was a cool video. I'll put a link in the description in case you want to go watch that video. It was, it was very, muy interesante. Verdad, Amelia? Verdad, she said. We haven't started our official hike yet, but we're already getting nature <laughs> in the form of the sapote tree right behind me. And there is a little mandarina tree next to the sapote tree. Me encanta sapote. I don't no, like it as Amelia much. No le gusta. It's kind of stringy. Yep, yeah, I love it. Look at this papaya. Those are ginormous and they're still babies. They're going to be really big when they're done growing. Some of the papaya trees do not produce fruit and our guy just said that those are macho trees. <laughs> <laughs> male trees. I didn't know there was a difference with male and female papaya trees, so they need pollination. Este un árbol de naranja. This is a naranja tree. We love naranjas. They make delicious juice. Is that a Wanabana tree? It is. I love Wanabana. Bum, bum, Wanabana. <laughs> These will get really big. Muy grande. The cutie. Hola. <laughs> Hola. So far, so good. Yep. Love hearing those birds. More sense for me to actually make it functional for myself. That's good. Don't fall in. <laughs> Muchos caballos. Muchos. Bebés también. Like a walking stick. Ah. <laughs> Muy bien, Amelia. Yes, these are waterproof. Esa es la medicina del árbol. Guairo molado ancha. Cuando el mono, el monkey lo, lo disparan, sí. ah. enfermo se cura con la hoja. Sí. Oh, so the monkeys use that for medicine? Medicina para sí. los monos? Ajá, yeah, huh, sí. Ah, oh, it's every. Pretty. Wow. Amelia, I think there's some action happening on your hat. Really? <laughs> there are two moths that appear to be in the throes of passion. <laughs> Passion de amor. Well, I guess I'll have to watch the video. <laughs> Buena. Sí. Muy buena. Sí, muy rica. Guayaba también, helado. Helado de guayaba. Oh, you see. Sí, es una guayaba, Amelia? Sí, es muy rico. Muy rico. Muy rica. Dulce? Rica. dulce? Sí. It's sweet? Not super sweet, but yeah, it's really good. You should try it. We are in the rainy season and this river is dry, which helps explain some of the water restrictions that we have going on right now. If you missed our Alone is Booming video, I'll put a link in the description. We talked about the water restrictions and the multi-year drought that we're in the middle of and there's water shortages. There have been water protests because uh, the locals would like to have water. So they need a pipeline or a desalination plant, which has not been built yet. Not sure that they have the funding for it along this stretch of coast. Salinas and La Libertad are fine. They have water from Guayaquil. Ayampe North has water from Manta. 
but the stretch of coast, including Montanita alone in Dos Mangas, has severe water shortages right now. So some are worse than others, but we're all on restrictions. So hopefully they'll get some water soon. Behind me is a large castor tree or plant. I didn't realize they got that large. It's neat to see the little berries that they actually use to make the castor oil. And ricin. Oh yeah. <laughs> Do not eat. So, ten cuidate. <laughs> Este un arbol de mame, which is an orange fruit that tastes a lot like a pumpkin pie, especially when you sprinkle a little cinnamon on it. It's muy rico. It is. We love it. There are more mame trees. They're so massive. They just go up forever. Here, es este. Tiene la tagua. Oh, tagua. Sí, mire. Wow. Así. Maduras. Sí. Después seca, se pela y después eh, ya viene a pasar lo que es artesanía. Cool. Sí. Wow. Oh, it's heavy. This is really neat to see it in its natural form. So this is like plant-based ivory. Yeah, it's they, beautiful. They use this to make all kinds of jewelry and such. They use the entire tree. Yep, they do. Las vacas. El toro allá. El papá de los otros. <laughs> the bird call sounds like a meow meow. <laughs> Como un gato. <laughs> they like to make necklaces out of these berries. They're really bright red and very pretty. El guía está caminando muy rápido, mi guía. Sí, es muy bien. Y se queda el blanquito. Sí, hay una cosita para sacar esto. Oh, yeah. Sí, si no que ahorita lo saco así con la uña para hacer un proceso más. So you have to remove all the green part. Es para los insectos. Ajá, también para los insectos. Sí. <laughs> y para la paja toquilla también. Para hacer el sombrero. El sí, ya. Yeah. Aquí, ajá. I like it. <laughs> Sad to see all these creeks dry during the rainy season. It is, although we didn't have much of a rainy season. I know that's the, the why they're dry. <laughs> exactly. Hope there's water in Las Cascadas, the Ho waterfalls. Hopefully so. Look at all that bamboo, Amelia. I should have brought your machete. Could have put you to work. No, it's too <laughs> very funny, but it's also muy joven. They're reforesting this area. You think that's a bus stop? <laughs> Maybe back in the day. <laughs> <laughs> Man, imagine growing up out here and having that as your bus stop. That'd be pretty amazing. Necesita agua, Amelia? Si. Looks like you're sweating a little bit. I am a little sweaty. <laughs> <laughs> This is a 40 year old cacao tree. I didn't realize that they got this big. And or we, that old. Or that old, yeah. And they're still producing fruit. We saw a little baby cacao plant. Or I guess it's a pod. Bean? Put pod. Pod. <laughs> Creo que es pod. I should know this from our chocolate class. <laughs> café. Wow, my favorite chocolate and coffee in one short hike. Amelia, are you going to be a real tree hugger? Yes, because there's a lot of energy from this tree. 
Can you feel it? Um, not really. <laughs> Just enjoy the tree. Yes. <laughs> it's neat, there's like little roots growing down it. Do you want to give the tree a hug, JP? It's the good vibes tree, JP. That is a giant tree. It is. It's amazing. We saw one of these in uh, Saluna, remember? Oh, yeah. It's, it's beautiful. It's like the tree of life. Yeah. Estamos allá, Amelia, a las cascadas. So I always wondered how fish got into mountain streams like this or like isolated lakes in the mountains. It turns out that fish eggs can actually survive the trek through a bird's gastrointestinal tract. Who knew? So that's how you end up with fish in places like this where it just doesn't seem like they would exist. Take the hombre, Amelia. Is it almost lunchtime? I think so. Right, Mas escaleras. Amelia, you gonna come back and carry me? <laughs> it's quite a bit cooler up here, Amelia. It is. Well, the big waterfall is completely dry, so we're just gonna, I'm gonna get in this cool, small waterfall. It looks beautiful. Cascada Pequeña. Si. Sí. Coco Frio. Si. Sí. Good thing you like cold water, JP. Is it as cold as the piscinas from the last hike? Si. Sí. Oh, wow, okay, ah. well, I'm definitely not getting in there. Whew. <laughs> Is that enough? <laughs> it's pretty cold. I got away from you. Ah! <laughs> <Ooh. laughs> How's it feel? It's cold. <laughs> I'm not even getting close to you. <laughs> I'm just gonna sit back here in the dry area and take your word for it. <laughs> That was a lackluster wave, JP. Is your hand frozen? <laughs> ah, there's one of those ginormous spiders. I might need to run across the water like you did. It is so peaceful and relaxing here, but we cannot stay all day. Nope, so we're gonna head back down to the bottom and we will see you all when we get there. Amelia, I think your hat is the love nest. <laughs> Ma, <masa> mord. <laughs> that is a toucan, but we can't see it. Or toucan, as it's pronounced in Espanol.
We are back down at the visitor center. It took us about four hours, but we did spend about an hour yeah. filming. So it took us a little bit longer than normal. And it's a easy to moderate hike. It's a low elevation gain, except for some stairs at the end to get to the Cascadas. But give yourself plenty of time and bring lots of water and snacks because once you leave the Dos Mangas area, the Comuna, there are no services on the trail. Yep. All right, guys, I think that's all we have for this video. If you enjoyed seeing and hearing the jungle sights and sounds, leave us a like, please. Yes, please. We hope you have an unconventional day and we'll see you all in our next video. Ciao. Ciao.